Hey guys, welcome back. Today I have another top 10 video for you and today I'm going to be doing my top 10 gray polishes. I personally love a good gray polish, especially in January. I feel like January is the dreariest of the months. It seems to somehow drag on forever no matter how quickly it goes by. That makes no sense, but something, I just, whatever, January is like, wow. It's because the weather's usually crap. I chose 10. They are all mainstream and they are all cream polishes or have a slight shimmer to them. I didn't want to choose holographic or glitter because that would be like 40 additional polishes. So these are all creams or shimmer type polishes. So if you guys want to see my top gray picks, then just keep watching. Some of them look very similar, but they are all actually different colors. They may not, they may not look like it, but they are all actually different colors, even though they look very similar. The first is from Bonita. This is the Bonita Salon uh, gel formula in Tech Savvy. I love these Bonita polishes. I think that they are very well formulated. They are, I think, $249, $299. They're so affordable. They're available on their website at bonitacolors.com, I think it is, or at Rite Aid. But I love this color. It's a nice dark gray cream, and it just looks, I just love how this looks on the nails. It looks so nice and chic. The next one is from China Glaze, and this is from their fall collection, uh, their Street Regal collection. This is called Street Style Princess, and it's kind of just a plain dove gray cream. But it had a really nice formula and it just looks clean, but it's not a stark. It, it looks. I like how this looks as a clean manicure without being stark white nails because I do like stark white nails, but sometimes I want something a little deeper and smokier, I guess. And I, I feel like this fits the bill. So this is two coats of Street Style Princess from China Blaze. China Blaze has some good gray polishes. Um, the next one is also from China Blaze. This is Recycled. This is a classic China Glaze cream. I, I feel like everyone probably has this or has heard of it. It's been around forever. This is a warmer gray. Uh, it has a little bit of brown in it. And it's just a nice gray cream. The next one is from Nails Inc. This is the called Hide Place Park and this is a cool toned light gray. It's a little bit lighter than Street Style Princess and this is just a polish that I like to wear with, I actually really like this polish paired with pale pink, but I also just really like it on its own. I like the Nails Inc. formula and I think that this is a good gray, so Hide Place Park. Now we have the deepest of all of the grays. This is from OPI. This is called Live in the Gray, and it's from their Washington D.C. collection. Washington, yeah, Washington D.C. collection from was that two years ago? But this is called Live in the Gray. This is a deep. This is a dark gray. This is basically charcoal, but I still consider charcoal in the gray spectrum, so I'm including it. A really nice formula, and it just it just looks so classy on your nails when you have gray or dark gray nails. Next we have one from Orly. This is called Up All Night and this is a this is a silver with a lot of shimmer in it so there's a little bit more dimension to this polish than just a plain cream. It doesn't look straight up metallic but there's that the shimmer with the gray look, makes it look a little more interesting than just a plain cream polish if you're looking for a little more a little more zhuzh to your manicure. Up all night by Orly. The last four are all from Zoya. I didn't, I tried not to do that, but I love all of these grays a lot, so I had to include all of them. Sorry. The latest one is, of course, Dove. This is one of my favorite Zoyas. I've shaken it all up so you can't see the fill line, but there is actually a fill line on this polish, which never happens. This is lighter than Street Style Princess and warmer, and then it's also lighter than the nails ink one and also warmer so they're all they're all necessary this is perfect for nail art or again if you just want to wear a nice clean looking gray manicure i like this one 
next one is called August and it is a little bit deeper cooler gray this one is probably closest to street style princess but you can see that this one is darker and it just again it just has a nice formula and it looks nice on your nails so Zoya's August the next one is Zoya's Tao and this is one of my first Zoya's ever is Zoya's Tao and then the last one is Zoya's Kelly this is a dark and this one is a little bit darker than tech savvy but obviously not as dark as live in the gray love this color but this is a great dark gray cream formula and you can do a lot with this as I've said for all of these pretty much it's great for nail art it's great for a base it's great for a plain manicure I just think that this looks sophisticated so that is it I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know what your favorite gray polish is and let me know what color you want to see next in the color series I feel like for some of the colors I will have to break them up into like light blue dark blue light pink dark pink <laughs> I have to break them up because I and green I think it's gonna greens and blues are gonna need like four categories each so let me know what color you guys want to see next. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.